okay welcome back those chain gang those chain fam so we got a little bit misled but anyway we are making the comeback of the century so that being said let me just get rid of a couple of these things but anyway before i do get fully into this if you guys could leave a like comment sub all that fun stuff for the channel growing i really do appreciate it uh helps with the youtube algorithm and all that fun stuff and it's kind of like giving me a fist bump and it lets me know that you guys do like the what i am putting out so yeah other than that before i do get into this last thing is i will be away in the next couple days so if you guys do want me to update you guys again with those chain or anything else uh tweet at me uh link to twitter's in description and uh or discord anyway getting into it so um anyway we ended up falling back down we're back at three zeros nine three zero so we're gonna look at this in a very um cut and dry kind of way so one you're either gonna break down past these lows and you're going down to the 618 which is at three zeros six two one uh if it does that that's a snag opportunity honestly in my opinion uh getting it close to half a cent because uh in my opinion those chain once you get a full proper bull market and like full proper uh dog coin season going on uh this thing will moon in my opinion at least uh and getting it closer to half a cent is uh pretty good because i do think that this could actually even hit like a dollar but that's besides the point no need to fill pipe dreams right now but anyway uh i am digressing so cut and dryness of this is uh you're either going to come back down break these lows and then tag the 618 which is at about uh 30621 or you're gonna probably end up bouncing from here because well you are at essentially support right now as you guys can see each time that you come down relatively close to these areas you do end up finding like a bounce up even over here you did back test over here and you actually didn't even end up breaking that low yet where my cursor is compared to right now and the other thing that i am seeing at least on the daily time frame is if we do look to down here back from march 28th on the rsi and where we are right now so march 28th we made a low right here and we just made a lower low if we take a gander over at the rsi made a low on it on the 28th as of right now we are making a higher low which is an indication to what you may ask i'm so glad you asked it actually means the quadratic formula nah um uh you do have bullish divergence right there so uh that is something to keep in mind as well but um as of right now on the daily time frame i i do think it should pop up next week to be quite honest but uh the only thing that i definitely need to see come out of this is that we need to see closures above this prior high uh we need to get closures back into uh zero point uh two zeros ten instead of three zeros so we gotta start seeing closures above there but um honestly 1060 would be nice to see even if maybe like this fib level that's the one two three six but um other than that that's really about it uh i don't have anything else necessarily for doge chain but uh you're either going to find a strong bounce out of here or you're going to break down into this box that's really essentially it because you can see literally all through here uh, i know you guys can't see my finger but i'm just pointing along the screen so right around here this is your like major support you've hit it here 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 so that being said it should hold should it break uh probably will be a fake out if i were to guess um and yeah otherwise you should see a bounce it's very binary i keep repeating myself because it's literally it's that cut and dry at least for right now uh what i'm leaning a bit more towards is you may be wondering uh i do see the divergence uh on the daily time frame so I guess i want to say a little bit more upside but that's why i was saying i really need to see the close like i need to see a decent sized pump in itself just getting the closures back up to this like two zero mark uh and then i'll feel better then I i'll still think that you have a lot more to go towards the upside from there but um 
yeah if you don't and especially if you were to take out like this low with the closure which is at about uh three zeros eight seven two then i think you probably go down at least retest these lows if not then you are going to that area that we marked but other than that none of this is financial advice these are all just my thoughts and opinions and you guys have a phenomenal day as always adios muchachos